As a nation, Somalia is in the midst of rebuilding. The parliament is a symbol of these efforts. There are few functioning public services, many staff capacity challenges, and very little civil society outreach. Public discussions on legislation have been exceedingly rare, and never has the national budget been publicly discussed in the post-conflict period until now. When we first put on the table public hearing, budget public hearing, it was a new phenomenon. The process before, the one we used to practice for so long, was not to ask the people anything, only to, to do it. In 2017, the Somali government held the first public budget hearing of its kind, inviting the public to listen and offer their opinions on spending allocations. When we were informed to participate in the first public hearing, we have ever heard. At that time, we did not know any about what the budget is. The uh, hearing, the budget is approved by parliament, but some of them, they don't know what's inside the budget. They need to know the existence of the budget in the state, in the republic. Others, they need to know that this money is their own money from their pockets, and it will be used back to them. This is a live hearing, and some of the people, sometimes they are asking uh, <laughs> and hot questions. That's what we are fearing before. We were very eager to have a, a sort of contribution from the civil society, but at the same time we were having such kind of concerns also to answer their questions. Health, uh, also the other sectors, especially education and health, it's uh, small. There were a lot of, uh, you know, mis misinterpretations. We were, we ha we were having a concern is how you present in front of the people. Below the wooden base, oh, I like it in 2017, it was a landmark in the history of budget presentation of, the, of Somalia. It is a good opportunity that the people have the right, and we, we get the right to, to, to participate in the public hearing and say we wanted this and this, and the location should be changing this to this. This was very amazing things. I was thinking that I was going to say 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 that I was The USAID-funded Strengthening Somali Governance Project engaged with members of civil society and the Budget and Finance Committee by building their capacity to conduct budget analysis, develop budget reports, and advocate for clarifications and changes in the setting of a public hearing. We highly appreciate how the SG has been support to the, our committee clerks and even the committee themselves how to prepare the legislations. We received a lot of appreciation letters from the civil society by saying thank you for having us, you know, attend this such kind of budget hearing and we do believe that our, our ideas or our contributions will be considered. After two or three hours after the hearing, every person or all our committees, including the staff, they are satisfied what's happening there. Now they have the capacity that they can analyze what the committee has been done the day before yesterday or the last week or uh, one year after, they can summarize. The system now is in place. Anybody who comes in, unless they improve it more, they cannot go back. It's, uh, forward step to, to our government, to our institutions, and to every person. It's a right of their own. They know it's their right, and the government understands it's their right. Our community will not need expertise. We will be the expertise of the future.